Months had passed since the concert with Enna's and that big competition we entered. Haruhi seemed pretty happy after we came up with that silly dance, too. Koizumi and Nagato didn't even bother fighting for that. The worst part of it all was that we had to sing along with that stupid song. Haruhi didn't like Koizumi's in my voice, so only Nagato and Miss Asahina sang. I felt a little bad for them, but I felt even worse for the fact that I had to do the dance. Only the chorus, but that still goes against a man's thoughts and dignity. After spending so much time with Haruhi Suzumiya, I was starting to get used to the idea that aliens, time travelers, espers, and anything else fantasy were actually real. Looking at Nagato, I was really surprised to catch her not reading every now and again. I don't mean like every other day, more like every other month. Coming to the classroom every day must have changed a lot of us. I just go there automatically now. It's just become a daily thing where after school or during our lunch break, I go up and play Othello with Koizumi. Or just look out the window and wonder to myself, what big adventure does Haruhi have planned next? Or I sometimes try to talk to Nagato and start a conversation. Of course, those plans don't normally work. And Miss Asahina just continues to go through whatever Haruhi makes her do. So, on any other ordinary day, nothing special happened. Then Haruhi decided to change that. I just got a big idea! After slamming the club room door and disturbing the peace again, you think she'd actually hesitate before she does that kind of stuff, right? Well, here's your answer. Warm up your voices, everyone! We're gonna start singing again! Singing? Like when she wrote that song that was stuck in our heads and we had to fight some big monster thing in order to stop it? We have to sing again? Miss Asahina looked a little distressed. Koizumi just smiled, but if you were in my shoes, you could tell it was a little concerned. Nagato didn't even look up from the book. Of course, I just stood there, dumbfounded by Haruhi's little statement. I had no clue how to react. I just know that I don't like the looks of this. After Haruhi made that little announcement, the mood became more tense. She started to explain why she wanted to have us sing again. <sighs> First aliens, time travelers, and espers, now singing and dancing. We all have a little something to say, right? Why don't we all get together and start singing again? You know, to remember the good times? Good times? Like all those random times you grabbed me by my collar or tie and dragged me around the school? Or the time you blackmailed the president of the computer club? Or you dressed up in bunny girl outfits? Or how about the time I was almost killed by Ryoko Asakura? Or when Yuki and Mikuru and Koizumi all told me about you and your crazy antics? And let's not forget the time with your silly baseball game. <laughs> hey, Kyung! Get out of Wonderland already! I already asked the girls from Eno to help us make the music and stuff. Now all we need are singers. 
Haruhi looked at each and every one of us, and as she did, a great big smile stretched across her face. We'll all sing! We'll even get a few other people to sing with us! And we'll each have our own CD. Surya san will come, I bet. Hey, Kyung, could you get your sister to help too? You know she loves hanging around. Hey, slow down. Don't just assume that everyone will do as you say. Could you at least ask first before you get ahead of yourself? Fine. Itsuki, do you mind having your own song, plus your own version of Hari Hari and Kai? Yes, I think I will. If we weren't using instruments, then I guess so. Mikuru? Yuki? It is all right with me. All right, that's everyone. Huh? Now all we need to do is ask Surya-san, Kion's sister. Hey, Mikuru, whatever happened to that girl? You know, the computer geek's girlfriend? Even though she wasn't really his girlfriend. You mean Miss Kimidori? I still see her around. Would you like me to ask her? That'd be great! Haruhi thought for a moment, then slammed her hands down on the table with the Othello game on it. The pieces all flew into the air and crashed on the table. Thanks, Haruhi. Ask Surya-san, too. She'd be perfect at singing. I wonder if her singing skills are good as her nose flute skills. Wait, why is it so important that you have to have so many people? Why can't it just be the five of us? Kyung! You have to ask your sister, alright? Make sure she gets involved somehow. Guess it doesn't matter what I say, right? Because! People want more action and need more entertainment! The more people, the better. We only have eight people. We need one more. Hey, does anyone remember Asakura Ryoko? I want her to come back. I bet she'd have a pretty voice. Mm -hmm. Oh well! I think it was this topic that made it happen. After Haruhi was finished with her little rant about the scene the CD thing, Nagato was looking up at me. That was a sign that meant she was going to talk to me again about Haruhi. Ha! This is going to be a lot of fun! Hmm? <laughs> Please, go have your fun. Go play delusions with other people. Just leave me out of it.